Hey guys, this is Sam, and today we'll be talking about the changes in iOS 9.3 Beta 3. You can look at today's beta in two different ways. If you're a Verizon subscriber, then you're probably going to love it, and if you're not a Verizon subscriber, or you don't have the Verizon cell service, you're probably going to be indifferent about it. Because the big change in iOS 9.3 Beta 3 is that Wi-Fi calling for Verizon is finally here. Now, I'm not currently running a phone that has Verizon service active on it, but if I go into the settings, if you were running a phone that had active Verizon service on it, you could definitely go ahead and see it. This is just an old spare phone, so I don't have active self-service on it. There's also a few other small changes in iOS 9.3 Beta 3, and both of them pretty much deal with Control Center. If you're playing an explicit song and you're in Control Center, the E is now black and it used to be white, and the same is true if you're on the lock screen. And also when you activate Night Shift mode, there's a new dialog under Night Shift in the pop-up that says from sunset to sunrise, that was just missing in previous betas. So all in all, iOS 9.3 is a relatively small update. It's only out for developers now, but I could definitely see it going into a public beta in just a few days following. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to drop a like down below, and of course subscribe for more content related to iOS 9.3. This has been Sam with iUpdateOS. I hope you guys had a great day, and I'll talk to you in the next one.